I love all bitches. Brown square over bitches. Rich poor slave bitches. Smart dumb crazy bitches. Rude horny dirty bitches. Ah, all right, well guys, we're gonna fix our uh, air rooms. How much is this? Two hundred and. 25,000, no, okay, for full, okay, that's not too bad, anyways, um, so yeah, we are basically 99 magic, 270 experience tilt, and our construction is, come on, 46 experience tilt, holy shit, like, and fucking advertising my, gone my goddamn video, anyways, yeah, these help drops are just a few things I've gotten from, uh, killing those things, I guess it's kind of good drops here and there, um, I got a Berserker Helm I actually missed as well, and I also got one here. Um, Berserker Helms look so much different than before. Like, look at that. How much is this worth? Oh, they're all 45k. Okay, anyway. And the Great Master one. I don't want to know what the hell this is going to sell. Please sell for at least middle, please. Come on. And holy fuck. That's, that's not bad. Anyways, I'll be back a little later on. I'm going to go quickly get a quick snack. And I guess next time I might go do a little bit of thieving probably. So you guys will see me thieving in the next clip. So I'll see you guys then. And I did actually get my hunter level to 95, guys. Um, I was going to get it from the hunter level thingy here, but I ended up getting it from a lamp. Didn't even realize how close I actually was, um, so I had to pull the recorder out. But yeah, 95 hunter, very close to maxing now. And I will see you guys in the next clip. Geek. Hello, 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 big dick sub. So, um, I got some goodish news for this account. I think I'm going to start doing some Jinko hunting because it is time for me to get 99 hunter and max out this account. So one thing I'm doing at the moment is hunting the uh, the corrupt vines. These things create the hunting potions, um, and you know then I can start hunting the dragonic jadinkos. So um, today I think I'm gonna get my uh, like my leggings, then hopefully get my top a little later on, uh, so I can attract the jadinkos a little bit better. But yeah, that's actually not a bad experience. I get 500, yeah, 581 experience, 580 for just getting one of these. It takes like 20 seconds. Anyway, this is my collection so far. I got about 15 Urzils, and I'm still going to be doing a little bit more. But to make my first hunting potions, guys, ready? Right here. Ah, uh, 123 herbs. Stop. And I got the message from that guy. Run, 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 run. Give me my legs or my top, whichever one. Um, I want to improve my hunter. How much hunter experience? 17. That's not bad at all. And we got the top. Ah, nice. Anyways, I later on went in and traded my daily challenges. I have obviously five daily challenges I gotta do. I traded in my hunting one, I got 40k freaking experience, and then I traded in my mining one and got 20k experience. Never thought I'd get that much hunter experience. It's kind of crazy. Anyways, as you guys can see now, basically in the background, I am hunting the Dragon Jadinkos. I think I gained around 300k um, hunter experience today. I did use a uh, the aura thing, the 50% boost one, um, just to get a little more experience for this because I kind of forgot to do it yesterday, and I was doing my um, that daily hunting crap. Um, the butterfly crap, uh, big chinchampa, yeah, that shit. I gotta tell you, I always thought that, you know, starting up Jadinko hunting actually takes a lot of time, but honestly, it, it honestly takes no time, guys, to start up Jadinko hunting. All you gotta do is the first thing I was doing this clip, like the first few things I was doing was collecting those corrupted vines, uh, which is that one thing I showed you guys. Um, once you get that, you get a few corrupt vines, which makes the hunting potions, then basically you're good to go. All you gotta do is plant a few Urzil seeds, or Urz, how the fuck you wanna say it. You can get those from uh, hunting common Janinkos or uh, fire making Janinko layer. That's a great way to get it. Or just kill the mutated Janinkos in the layer and then you cash it in for the points. Um, or the, for the, uh, the herbs. Well, I guess the herb seeds, actually. But yeah, boy, it took me a few minutes just to get this all started, and I was good. I just had to make sure my um, the one Urzils I planted, like, you know, grew, because I didn't have to want to wait again. So, yeah, I got a, a few hunting potions right now. I don't really need too many more. Um, I'll still be doing the hunting daily thing, and then I'll be doing this on the side, um, you know, whenever I just want to do a little bit of hunting and quickly max out. So as you guys can see, I am 95. Uh, I'm actually not too far from 96 right now, I don't think. Let me go check right now. I'm on this account right now. So 516k right now to 96. But tomorrow I'm going to be doing like basically four hunting mini games because I didn't do them today. And I'm going to probably do a little more Jadinko hunting with the aura thing. So I should get 96 tomorrow possibly. Probably 97 in like three or four days. And maybe within the next week I might even get 99. I might just kind of no life it with the Jinkos. Well, actually, if I was a no life, I could probably get 99 tomorrow. But I don't really want to do that. But yeah, I think I might go Living Rock Caverns tomorrow as well. Just finish off mining a little bit. I have about 450k till 99, which is not too bad. Uh, I want to finish it off tomorrow. I shouldn't take any more than five hours, even if I just like AFK, basically. Um, and construction of magic are right there anyways. I'm actually nine experience till 99 magic. Didn't really realize how close I was. I was using fertilized soil, whatever, like the magic spell from Lunars. Um, like it counts as like super compost. And I'm literally nine experience off. So thank God I did not plant one more goddamn thing or else I would have got 99 by an accident. But yeah, it looks like next video could be a 99 mining, magic, and construction video. 
And then all I have left is Thieving and um, Hunter. And Hunter should probably be 96 or 97 by then. And Thieving, I am currently 500k to 98. So I could probably get that in a day to 99 as well. So, yeah, it looks like Road to Max Cape Series is basically done. I'm, I'm pretty much there. I just have to play a few more hours and I'm good to go. Now, I was thinking about doing Completion Escape, and I think I actually might do it. I'm not too positive about it yet, but I might. I mean, there's a lot of things I don't really want to do again. Um, and, you know, but, you know, whatever. If it's kind of like a new series, I can start up again and kind of have a little more fun and do a bunch of brand new things. I don't really mind doing it then. Plus, like I always say, I got two Completion Escapes. What a... But yeah, that's going to wrap the video up here, guys. Now, I want to know what you guys are using your aura thing for. If you got, like, the season, the, what is it called? It's called the um, Festive Aura. Yes, Festive. I was thinking about using it for, like, a viable skill, but since it only has, uh, you know, 50k, uh, you know, at the ending, it's just, like, crap, right? So I basically just do agility on my main account, and then on my newbie account, I'll either do uh, hunting or mining. But normally, it's just hunting now, because that's probably the most annoying skill for me. Uh, and yeah, that kind of wraps up the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next Road to Max Cape video, which should be getting 399s and then pretty close to the last two skills. So Thieving and uh, Hunter will be my last skills, basically. And I guess Thieving will be my second last skills. So um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I guess I will see you guys next video. Giggity, 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 goo.